never ever draw Genshin Impact characters. Why you may ask? Because I'm jealous. Why are they so good? Why are they so detailed? Also, why is this little kid using weapons? And why is he not wearing clothes? Why is her forehead so big? It's literally bigger than mine and I can land an entire airplane on it. Was Aloy even on anyone's team? Because I never saw anyone use her. Okay, so the conclusion of all of this is that I'm jealous of all these amazing characters and today I decided to draw them and make myself suffer because all these character designs are so detailed. So to make work lighter on myself, I decided to draw them in modern version or like modern outfit and to draw that I used the Huion Inspiroid 2S pen tablet which was kindly sent to me by the team over at Huion and here is a quick unboxing of it and everything that comes uh, with the pen tablet. Bye. It literally took me like legit 5 minutes to get the tablet even out of the box because it was so confusing but that's just because I'm so dumb and not the fault of packaging. I got mine in the sakura pink color because it's literally so pretty. There are two color options which is sakura pink and black but I got mine in sakura pink and here is the tablet itself which I'll be opening later. It comes with a guide or a brochure which I know I will never read so let's just keep it back again. Uh, here is the USB cable to connect it to your laptop and this is like a USB thingy to attach it to your phone and stuff. It's pretty helpful and here is a pen stand. It's so cute. I honestly love it so much. It also has extra nibs inside and here is the stylus and here is the tablet itself when i first unboxed it uh, my first impressions were that it feels and looks very high quality anyway i'll talk more about the tablet further into the video let's move on to the drawing part so the first character i'm drawing is raiden shogun because I know she's a fan favorite. So yeah, I obviously have to draw her. I decided to give her a very Y2K fashion outfit because that's what all the fashion girlies are wearing right now. And I'm really happy with the outfit. It looks really pretty on her. Like, look at that. But at the same time, Genshin, what is that? Like, what is that? I genuinely don't understand what was that. Like, was that a skirt or like... How does that practically and logically even make sense? Because she's like fighting 10 million monsters in the game. So like, what? Now I'm going to quickly fill in the base colors. I really love the color scheme I chose for this one. I mean, it was already given to me because of Raiden Shogun's color scheme. But it's still really good. I really love all the purples. It makes this character look so much cooler, you know? It's now time to start rendering and rendering using the Inspiroid 2S pen tablet was actually so much fun because whenever I use the pen it felt like I'm drawing on paper you know it gives that kind of a vibe and I really like how that feels plus it also has a lot of shortcut or the express keys and it makes your life so much easier because using the driver you can like set shortcuts on the tablet itself and you won't have to touch the keyboard again and again so like that's such a plus point bruh why are leather boots so difficult like no matter what i did they always ended up looking weird and i was trying to add like the shinies to make it look like leather but it just kept on looking worse but i pulled through and now i'm adding the final details like the shadows and the highlights for this character and i am done with raiden shogun yay Now I'm going to draw Yoimiya and I chose her myself because she is too pretty to not be drawn and like when I used to play Genshin Impact I was like oh my god I really want Yoimiya because she is so pretty. Also look at her outfit it's so good and goofy at the same time like who has bandages as tops but she looks good in it so yay. Ooh. 
One difficulty I found while sketching both of these characters was that my pen used to lag a little bit when I'm sketching and the lines used to like delay and that was only when I was using pressure sensitivity and when I turned it off it was back to normal so I don't know if it's a, like the drawing program's fault or like the tablet's fault but yeah that happened when I was using pressure sensitivity so I turned it off but other than that I really haven't found any other flaw in this pen tablet like it can be small for some people but like if you are a beginner and you are looking to find a new pen tablet I think this is a really good option because it's not as small as you think it's like the perfect size for a beginner and even I can make pretty drawings with it so you can too and for its price being only 3750 rupees I think it's a really good purchase so if you want to buy this tablet I'll link it into the description This drawing was literally such a pain because I was literally about to cry like it was not turning out how I wanted it to but yeah this drawing had to go through multiple surgeries so that I could save it and I think I saved it and I really like it now also thank you so much to Huion for sending me the Inspiroy 2s pen tablet for me to review and here is the quick speed paint of both the drawings I did today I really love both of them now and I really like how I interpreted them in the modern version and I really hope you guys like it too and if you did make sure to like comment subscribe and I'll see you guys in my next one until then goodbye